The Borno State Governor has appealed to the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees to key into its durable solutions and humanitarian peace development nexus plans in addressing humanitarian crises and sustainable plans for building the resilience of displaced persons in Borno State. The governor stated this during a courtesy visit from the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees at the Government House in Meiduguri. Trust TV's Beatrice Guruti reports on this and other stories. The United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees' courtesy call on the Borno State Governor is to strengthen ties towards the needed humanitarian assistance for displaced persons and refugees in neighboring countries. The discussion focused on sustainable plans that will yield lasting solutions to humanitarian crisis and the Borno State Government's durable solutions and humanitarian peace development nexus plans on how displaced persons will be resettled, supported and protected. Governor Zulum, while explaining the component of these plans, said he wants to repatriate refugees from other countries. Why we shall work on with you to see how we shall immediately repatriate those that have been in Chad, as well as in Chad. I know the process is very cumbersome, time consuming, as well as money consuming. But together we shall get a sustainable solutions to our IDPs, both in terms of protection uh, we can see that this is very much in line with the objective that you have clearly laid out, Excellency, uh, and, and we believe that this is a direction in which we can go as the security situation improves. Uh, some will be able to go back to their place of origin, but we have to make sure that it is done sustainably in conditions of safety and dignity. Uh, and for that, investments are required in places of return. You also have individuals who will say, I want to stay after 10, 15 years in the place where I am. And they also need to be provided with, with, with that support. Meanwhile, the governor also received the governing council of the University of Meduguri and the government house. We have no any better affiliates than the University of Meduguri. All of us are major stakeholders. My main objective is to ensure that the University of Madugri regains its lost glory in terms of academic excellence. I will ensure I will support all initiatives from the governing council that will ensure growth and development of the university in a sustainable manner. I believe the founding fathers of this university would be proud of your investment in that university, either dead or alive. And uh, guys, I would like to, on behalf of the children and the people of Borno State, to request for more assistance, especially to the people and the children of the downtrodden. We have learned of the scholarships that have been given to the children of Borno State. And we would like also through your contacts, both nationally and internationally, to assist us so that we bring projects and programs that will definitely better the University of Meduguri. The governor assured the delegation of his support and commitment to partner with the university in areas of research and development to promote security and agricultural advancement. Beatrice Kuruti, Trust TV News, Beiduguri.